Hey everybody, it's Nicole coming at you with a quick Halloween DIY. Um, like I said in my previous video, hopefully it went up, um, I'm going to try to do a series of Halloween videos and at the end I'm going to show you how I incorporated all of the um, crafts and so forth on a tablescape and in, you know, decorative um arrangements or whatever so anyway this one is actually going to be i guess a combo video um i know a while back i said that i was going to do a rehash your trash uh tuesday's video so this is going to be both i'm actually reusing some items or repurposing some items that will normally get thrown away or whatever um into this craft so let's get started really really quick all i'm using is some recycled golf balls um nobody in my family golfs but my husband actually worked on a car that he eventually bought for my daughter and it has since been totaled by a unlicensed and non-insured driver but the person that previously owned the car had um tons of golf balls i don't know if he was an avid golfer or whatever but his trunk was literally full of bags of golf balls so anyway we ended up um throwing away a bunch um just donating some selling some serious it was just that many golf balls so i saved a few just for craft purposes so um, I got the best looking ones, even got some ones that had little color to them, whatever. I don't know anything about golfing. But anyway, kept the golf balls, and what I decided to do was to actually paint over just with some regular old um, gloss white craft paint. I recommend gloss because looking at just a regular ball, golf ball, it is somewhat shiny as you can see so I guess you want to kind of keep that look especially for this craft so I just took this plain old um craft paint in gloss and this is by Apple Barrel but you can get any kind of gloss um acrylic paint from the craft store and I just painted over the ball especially where there's writing and here let me show you again because some of them have their brand names and so forth so you want to cover those up so all i did was go over the i didn't paint the whole golf ball you can if you want to but i just touched over the little places where it had writing so i had a solid white golf ball like this one right here and then you could either use black um acrylic paint like these blue acrylic paints i have tons of paint but like here's the blue um this if you choose to but i'm using markers good old markers um these actually got on sale on clearance at Target um a while back and i hauled these a while back so all you want to do is create an eyeball <laughs> so i took the because it's a dual ended marker um any marker will do I took the fat or the wide end, if I can get it, and made a circle. So this is all you're going to do. Make sure it's dry now. You don't want to ruin your markers. But made a blue circle for, I guess, a blue eye. You can do brown, whatever color you choose to do. Um, I just looked at some images on Google google images just to kind of get an idea of how i wanted it to look and all you do is make a little circle like that and i love the fact that the golf ball is bumpy so it gives you a little texture when you're doing this and then you take your black one and you use the same end or whatever marker you choose to use and then you go in the center of that blue circle and make the black outline. And you just make it wider and wider until the white spot in the middle resembles the iris, I want to say. Pupil, I don't know. I don't know anything about eyes. But yeah. 
until you got that sort of eyeball-y effect. And then I took red craft paint. I tried it with the red marker, but I didn't like the way the red marker looked. So I took some red craft paint, squeezed a little bit here on my plate, and I'm just using a disposable plastic plate. And I took a piece of string, if you can see that. Here we go. And excuse the paint on my hand, or marker, ink. And I took the end of the paint, I mean the um, string, dipped it in the red so that I loaded it up with paint. And then I just went around those little um, dots that we made or circles that we made from the marker and made the vein that's usually in the eyeball like that. And that is it, y'all. And you can get as crafty and as creative if you want to when it comes down to this um simple little diy and again if you have a crap i mean a golfer or someone you know that has tons of golf balls like we found these <laughs> ask them for them you know rescue the golf balls save the earth so to speak um and recycle i have more um DIYs coming up for the upcoming holidays but for right now i'm using the golf balls as um decorative items for Halloween so yeah there is an easy 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 little craft and I think your kids will like this as well but this is great um <laughs> has a nice little decorative item on a tablescape um you can do a whole bunch of them and put them in like a jar a clear jar like you've got a jar of eyeballs um just get creative and do whatever but yeah that's all it is is a quick and easy eyeball um, made out of golf balls. So yeah, that is it. So stay tuned for the next video and until then y'all, I will see you then. Oh, and follow me on Instagram 334 Bama Girl and Twitter 334BG and until the next one, like I said, bye. <laughs>